qualifying match, 30. Red Alliance shooting during autonomous. Both Eagle Botics and Team Fire with power cells in the air during autonomous period. Now our drivers take control and it looks like Cybots managed one in that lower port. Starting our teleop period with Blue Alliance in the lead at 28 points. Cybot slow and steady, one at a time, but everyone counts towards powering the generator. Yes, power cells up by the Red Alliance here. Team Fire. Eagle Botics lined up. They've got a full hopper. So there's, there's two in. Here comes a third. And it's in. Blue Alliance working this side of the field. We have our Putnam Area Robotics Parts Team. Looks like Robo Raiders have a full hopper over here. They're kind of head towards getting these power cells in the port. 57 7 Static Store and driving Frank the Tank. Needs a few more power cells. We have 58 seconds left in the match. Close match, 34 to 31. Blue Alliance all working to line up to shoot for that upper, outer. Oh, and it bounced out. Oh, that's so, they're, that shot's so powerful, they're bouncing out of the back of the port. Frank the Tank, lining up. Looks like Parts is already headed to the center, looking for a uh, level hang, right on the center of that rail on the generator switch. Remember, a level hang earns an additional 15 points. Looks like Red Alliance also lining up. Red Alliance already got one robot in the air. Eagle Botics is off the ground. That's Eagle Botics off the ground. Oh, and our hanging mechanism for, that's for Putnam Area Robotics. They seem to have lost a part. All three Red Alliance robots in the area. Five points each. That will conclude. Scores coming up. That will be a win for the Red Alliance, 83 to 46. All Red Alliance teams moving up in the rankings during that round. End game, 35 end game points for the Red Alliance.